love a frog. When you imitate someone, imitate only what you can. If you try to imitate what is beyond your capacity, you will fail. Well, I am impressed by Little Froggy's nursing of his mother. Let's follow Little Froggy's good example. Kid and the Pipe One day, a wayward kid was grazing on the edge of a meadow apart from his companions. He should have stayed with his flock. Being self-willed, however, the kid came and found a spot with sweeter grass rather than grazing with the others. There, a hungry wolf caught sight of the kid. Ha! What a stupid kid! He is apart from his flock, and there are no goat herds or watchdogs. He is ideal for my lunch. Growl! With his mouth open for the young goat, the wolf pounced towards him. Help! Help me! The kid trembled and thought, This is my punishment for having left the flock. Oh God, help me! Suddenly, the wind blew, and the pipe on his back produced a faint sound. This sound of the pipe gave the kid an idea. Hi, Mr. Wolf. As I have just eaten some grass, it has not yet turned to flesh. If I move around and dance a little, the grass I ate will turn to flesh, and you can have that much extra meat. I see. I'd love to have some extra meat, even a little. Get moving and dance now. The kid handed the pipe he carried on his back over to the wolf and said, Please play the pipe as loudly as possible so that I can dance. The wolf played the pipe as hard as he could. Dancing vigorously to the pipe, the kid shouted, I think the grass in my stomach will become flesh soon. Please try to play harder. All right. The wolf blew even harder. Peep, peep, pee.
The sound reached the goat herd and dogs, and they came looking for the lost kid. Bow wow! Goodness, that's the sound of the kid's pipe calling for help. Wow! Bow wow! Surprised by the dogs who rushed to the scene, the wolf dropped the pipe and broke into a run. The goat herd let loose the dogs. There, dogs, go for the wicked wolf. I was fooled by the kid because I was greedy. The wolf thought angrily to himself, while his tail was bitten by the dogs who had caught up with him. Scolded by the goat herd and the other goats, the young kid also reflected on his conduct and admitted that the fearful experience was a result of his having broken rules and done as he pleased. The self-willed kid did what he liked, not listening to what the others said. The fearful mishap was punishment for his selfish conduct, wasn't it? So you should listen to what your mother says. The wolf was punished because he was greedy. You aren't too greedy, are you, dear boys and girls?
ある日わがままな子ヤギが群れから離れた牧場の外れで草を食べていました本当は群れと一緒にいなければならないのですでもわがままな子ヤギはみんなと一緒に草を食べるよりおいしい若草のある方へ勝手に群れを離れてきたのですところが腹をすかせたオオカミが子ヤギを見つけてしまいましたしめしめバカな子ヤギだ群れから離れてきたからヤギ番や番犬もいないぞ昼飯にちょうどいいやです。